Today I'm going to do a makeup video vlog diary. So, um, I'm going to start out with my Neutrogena um, primer. It's with Rice Protein Complex and um, it's really good to help absorb oil from the skin. Or actually, I'll start off with my prescription medication first. I read online that the Clean Sensitive, it doesn't need a primer, but it didn't say like it doesn't need a primer, it just said can wear alone. So, maybe I'll just skip a primer today. I just started wearing Parma recently. Okay. So once you get your application on, I'm going to use my, um, I'll use this um, CoverGirl Concealer 115 in Fair. It might be a bit light for me, but this is the CoverGirl Invisible. I'm going to first use a neutralizer, neutralizing concealer. This is um, a pale yellow to help neutralize under eye circles. So I'll just use that first. And it's to neutralize any redness or anything that you um, would like to conceal on your face. I'm going to use a airbrush concealer brush just because I woke up and I'm really exhausted today and I just want to feel good. So, blend that in. Blend it in quickly. Okay. Now I'm going to use this CoverGirl Invisible Concealer in Fair. I'm thinking I need a light because this Fair might be a little too light for me. <laughs> okay, just blend that in. I tried loading my pictures from um, my vegan, um, vegetarian trip to Las Vegas. The only vegetarian thing I had was honey in my coffee one day, but it was like super hot and I thought it would be a vegetarian option because I remembered sweetener. It might help like maybe make my elbow bone chart, but I remember that because I'm vegetarian, so I opted for that version. Um, yeah, let me get my mirror. So I was at the store yesterday and I got um, a physician's formula, um, how to bronze kit. And I'm really excited about that. I had a five dollar, no, four bucks up, no, rewards, four bucks up because I spent, spent um, I bought buy two equal tool brushes to get four bucks up. So I got two brushes and four bucks. So now I'm going to use this CoverGirl Clean. Excuse my nails. I'm really tired lately. So I got, I put my pictures on my Facebook page. I tried to make a video, but it would like take really, really long on YouTube. I want to do a picture video diary. So that's that. But I put them on Facebook and I have a link on my um, um, on my YouTube um, main website. Oh, you can click on that. Um, I'm going to try my new EcoTool foundation brush. It looks like this. I got mine with a good deal. So I got two brushes, got four bucks back. <laughs> so I got a... Um, I had a bronze kit, like I was saying, from Physicians Formula, and I just felt that it would be 
um, a really good way um, to make a video on how to bronze because it comes with instructions and okay, so I'm just gonna paint this on my face I guess I read a lot of things online about like start in the middle of your face oh this was from CoverGirl you start in the center of your face and you blend out so this CoverGirl Clean Sensitive is in Classic Beige 230, which I thought was a little light for me. I was at the store yesterday trying to figure out what what um I wanted to spend my four dollars on, and I thought, oh, buy one get one half off CoverGirl. I could get a darker color um, CoverGirl Clean Sensitive Foundation and a light invisible concealer. But I got the How to Bronze kit. Put a little more on my face. I'm going to close it and I'm going to shake it up. But yeah, I was wondering if this color is a bit too light for me. But oh well, I bought it and I'm stuck with it. <laughs> So, yeah, the stores always offer, um, like, return policies, but I like to be a good patronage, or a good customer, a good loyal, devoted customer to the stores, to the drugstore, so I, um, I try not to return stuff. I stopped returning stuff a while ago. So I read on the Walmart website that this foundation can be worn alone. I think that was for the pressed powder, but so yeah, the website at Walmart also said blend out from center of your face and and then blush. I'm going to do eyes after this. I don't have enough on my chin here. I need to have a little more. I woke up really exhausted and I was trying to drink my tea really funny and I was like, I want to make a diary makeup video off, but I'm so exhausted. How am I going to do this? But finally got the energy. Okay. I guess. Next, I wanted to use um, my... So I'm going to put this back in here. I want to use a Milani um, eyeshadow stick, eyeshadow crayon. I got it like 50% off. Um, I found it online that it's vegan. I called, this, I called them um, customer service and the person told me that it's not, um, not vegan, but online it was. So, yeah, this is by Milani. It's called Aquatic Style. And I'm just going to line my eyes with this. It's quite bright, so I'm going to blend it out. Oops, 
sorry. So I'm just gonna blend it out here. Blend it out on all over my eyelid. So it looks like a light color. When I got this, um, I was into the Wet n Wild Lavender. And I have the Wet n Wild um, Crayon Eyeshadows. Um, lavender, like the pearly color. And um, the, the creamy whitish color. Um, I think the green. I got them on sale. <laughs> okay. So, let's put that on my head like that. Um, next, I'm going to use the CoverGirl eyeliner, which is right here. This is in black. This is basic black. I'm going to line my eyes like this. the other side. So yeah, like I said, I'm really exhausted today. I'm just going to try to blend it out with the end of this sponge here. Oh. One eye looks different. It's really shaded down there. Okay, so now I'm going to use um, my, I wish I could find my um, white eyeshadow stick. I have them from um, NYC and Wet n Wild. So next I'm going to use my Physicians Formula Eye Brightener. I'm just going to use this brush. looks like this. I'm going to try to lighten my eyes a bit, put it on the inside corner. I'm going to try to lighten up this blue eyeshadow. So I'll just put it over like that. And it comes out looking light blue. It reminds me of the sky. And I just really love nature and I'm going to use a little down here. Okay. And now I'm going to use this. I should go for my pressed powder. Like I said, I'm really exhausted today. 
so use my pressed powder. I'll just use um, this brush. Where's my brush? Okay, I guess I'll just use my large. Oh my lord. I guess I'll just use my large powder brush. Like that. This color is buff beige. I really like how this, um, the clean sensitive worked on my skin. It's oil free, and I felt like. A, like a normal person at night, like I, did, I felt like I didn't have oily skin, and it just made me feel really good, and it reminds me of the um, CoverGirl um, oil control product. One time, the CoverGirl Clean oil control it absorbed a lot of oil, and then other times I used it. And it felt like it was more moisturizing, but my felt my face felt kind of like not as dry as I wanted it to. But I guess that's just because I didn't shake up the bottle, so it's a good idea to shake up the bottle. Okay, so once I have that on, um, I'm gonna. Good tool powder brush away, and I want to go to bronzer. So, oh, let me do eyes first. Where's my concealer? Conceal under my eyes better. Okay, well, I don't. No, with my concealers, I'm gonna use this CoverGirl Smoothers Concealer in Light. This has um, like Carnubular, um, Ginseng, Ginkgo, and Chamomile, which I love. Every time I'm at the CoverGirl station, or lately I'm at um, Extra Drugstore. There, that concealed under my eyes a little bit more. Cover up the powder. My eyeliner. I'll just use this in a dry concealer brush. Actually, no, I'm going to use a powder brush. So I'll use this um, Eco Tools Custom Buffing Brush. Oh yeah, so when I'm, lately I've been trying to look for a darker CoverGirl concealer, and I usually look at the Smoothers Light, but I can't remember which one I have. Do I have light or fair? <laughs> I have fair, but I ended up I have the light, so. Um, that's that. Um, eyebrows, I'm going to try this. No. I'll do that in a next video because I want to do a special on that when I'm not so tired because those are vegan products. And for bronzer, I'll just use the CoverGirl today. This is Spices. Looks like this. So I'm going to take this darker color and blend. on my cheeks. Give me some color. Put it down. My jawline. Two and three. The other side. Yeah. 
I noticed I have some breakouts on my chin. Okay, I guess I'll do that too. I need a little contour on my face, so I'm going to use this um, CoverGirl bronzer. my blush. Sorry I didn't have anything ready, like I said, I'm just really exhausted today, so I didn't think I was going to film a video, but I decided to. If I can't find my CoverGirl blush, I mean my CoverGirl bronzer, oh, I am going to go Crazy. I'm serious. Oh, there it is. All right. Okay. So I'm just going to open it. Looks like this. I'm using Golden Tan. And I'm just going to use my buck and brush. And I'll just go over it like this. My nose. And I'll just do the three again. It's already giving me a subtle glow like you could see. The other side of my nose, let's see how they look in the mirror. That's how it looks. <laughs> and all right, I have a glow. I hope you can see what I see. Like, I hope the camera makes it seem like normal. Like, what I'm actually wearing is what you can actually see. Not something different. <laughs> okay, so I'm just gonna. I do need a little blush today, so I'm going to try the CoverGirl Peaches Blush. Oh my lord. What if I use the blush to blow my nose up? How is that going to work? Okay, um, so I'm just going to use this Peaches Blush. And use my custom buffing brush. Find it. Okay. Oh, my position formula is just blurred. Okay. What am I doing? Okay. Blush brush. There it is. Pick up tools. The hot side I don't want the blush. I want the blush. So this is peaches. Just gonna swoop it over like this. The application is really light, so. I chose to get peaches because it reminds me of a nice, like, sweet occasion. So let's see, how do I look? Okay. Now for eyebrows. I'm 
do my eyebrows with my CoverGirl and Midnight Black. Just kind of whisk um, just kind of like the whisking motion. Or I just kind of sweep it over your eyelashes. It feels really good. I mean, over your eyebrows. It does feel really, really good, actually. And next, I'm going to use. Conditions Formula Eye Brightening Shadow just because I want to make lighter or maybe I should just Okay, so I'm really exhausted today and I already used the Physicians Formula Eye Brightener, so I'm going to use this Milani um, Brow and Eye Highlighter. I have that beige to get to highlight my eye, eyebrow and eyes here. So I'm going to use the lighter color on my really hard to open. Yeah, there you go. I'm going to use this lighter color. This is a vegan product. I'm going to go over here. My eyebrows up there. And I'll do something like that. I hope you can see. Give my eyebrows a little more definition. Okay. took off a little bit of color. And I'm going to use, let me drink some tea. <laughs> okay, so I gotta go. Um, I'm just going to use this Coral Twist Wet and Wild Lip Balm Gloss. So yeah, it's a finished look. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. And this is makes to do if you're really like I'm a question for you. What makes you feel awake? Mine is when I drink my caffeine in the morning and when I feel like I have really good energy going through my day. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye.